Right, hi everybody. Um, this is pepper. And pepper, look, what's that? Look at this pepper. Is not helpful for productivity. What's that? What is it? Yeah. Calendarly, Zapier, today a couple of great automation tools that help me book my time, get things done, and run my business when I don't have time to. Well, hi everyone, welcome to Better Creating. Uh, my name's Simon, if you've not been here before, this channel is all about simplifying creative life. So I make videos about productivity, things on Notion, creating better content. Now, Pepper is gonna be a bit of trouble, aren't you, when it comes to dealing with that. I thought I'd just, ah, get off, it hurts. Um, come on, it's all right. Distractions can be very difficult. Ah, get off, this is the problem, right? I'm trying to film a video. We have a new friend, it's very exciting. Uh, she's uh, a tabby and she's half Maine Coon, so she could get quite big. Um, and she's amazing. And we've had her for like a week and a bit. It's been quite an eventful week. A lot of playing, uh, there's a lot of eating, there's a lot of everything else that needs to be cleaned up at the moment. That's quite good fun. A lot of people have actually commented about how, you know, kind of morning routines and productivity is all very well and good. But when it comes to, you know, having children or young pets or any kind of stuff that you've got to deal with around it, it can be really tricky. I understand, I do get that. So I thought I just wanted to quickly share a really simple thing, which is about automation. Um, so when it comes to being productive, and particularly uh, you know, doing things like I do, which is using uh, my Notion system to organize my life, uh, one of the things that I have found helpful is to find automations that get a lot of the work done for you. Now one of the best things I've found is using Calendarly um, to automate how I book meetings and my time with other people. Having trouble negotiating with people about when to meet? This is how I've integrated Calendarly into my system so that I can book meetings and see them turn up simply in my Notion system or in my Google Calendar. And I can see things like this, a meeting, turn up with all the information that I need within it. If we go across to my Calendarly, check this out, an amazing thing. Sign up to Calendarly, you can create events. I've got a 30 minute conversation. I can set my availability, which I think is really brilliant within here. So I set that within here. And then of course, within my Google Calendar, um, it, I will have bookable time. Anything that is marked as busy will then um, remove the opportunity to book a meeting. So I, I don't get things wrong. Fantastic. Jump onto Better Creating. Down the bottom, I have embedded book a meeting. You click on that. And if you wanted to book a meeting with me, it would then give you options of when I'm free. And only times will show up here when I don't have something in my calendar. They can click on it, confirm it, and through that process, you can then add in your name, talk about what you wanna do, and book a meeting in with me. That will turn up then, amazingly, within Notion and show me that I need to do it. I absolutely love this Calendarly, Indify, and Notion system. If you want to check out more on how I manage my weekly schedule, come and check out my video on weekly scheduling in Notion and integrating Google Calendar and recurring tasks into that system. Brilliant. Automating digital products. One of the things that I'm doing is selling Notion templates. I'm using Gumroad to automate how I sell things. If you haven't heard of Gumroad, it's a really accessible and simple way to get set up selling digital products online really quickly. You simply go through these three stages of putting in the product details, setting up a simple checkout and sharing it via your website. Brilliant if you're interested in selling or uh, offering products, courses or any kind of um, digital asset to people for your business. So Pepper, do you think that they should check out my um, Notion um, templates. On my website there are a load of free and paid for templates. Uh, you can look at all the other videos. <laughs> it's really hard to do this. You can look at all the other videos um, on my uh, Simplifying Productivity playlist as well to build most of that yourself. But if you're interested in downloading a full version of my complete Life OS system, uh, that is available to download. Um, so thank you everyone for supporting me and the channel if you've chosen to do that. What's that? Look at this! automating everything else. Perhaps the ultimate tool, however, for automating your workflow is using something called Zapier. 
It's an amazing thing that uses something called Zaps, which connects different apps that you use every day and create automated triggers that fire depending on what you want to happen. Consider checking it out because for automating workflows, it's probably one of the best online tools that you can find. The reason I love Zapier is that it allows me, for example, to link up Gumroad with my mailing list. So where I, my newsletter, my email newsletter, I can link the emails into the mailing list and it saves me a load of work manually inputting them. Right, I'm down here. Come on, people want to see you. Meet you there. Yeah. I hope it was good meeting Pepper uh, and she's going to be around a little bit more, aren't you? Hey, a little bit more. Honestly, guys, the amount of like energy and time that is involved in looking after a cat uh, when you first meet them is quite amazing. Um, but we're, we're giving you the love, aren't we? We're giving you the love. Uh, hopefully back reasonably to normal service next week um, with my first collaboration, it is happening. Uh, Pepper has naturally come first uh, this week. Um, hit the like button if you enjoyed this. It would be awesome if you subscribe if you're not. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.